All right, hey guys, what's up? It's Austin again. Today, I'm not doing an adventure. I work and I work really late, so <laughs> I gotta stay awake. Can't get tired already before I have to go into work. But today, I've got something special. I don't know if you guys ever heard of Enchroma, but as far as I know, they're the only company that makes eyeglasses, eyewear, you know, like sunglasses, indoor glasses, all that, specifically meant for people with color deficiency or as you, as most people call it, colorblind people like me. I don't know how many of you don't really know me and how many of you do know me, but those who do know me mostly know that I am colorblind. I've been colorblind all my life. I don't actually think there is a way to develop colorblindness. I think you're just born with it. Um, mine varies all over the place, but for the most part, I'm Dutton, which is red and green colorblind. It's when I think in Chroma said when the green cone takes in too much red light or the red or the red cone takes in too much green light, something like that. Anyway, I've got a couple of packages here today and we're gonna open them up. I ordered, I used to have a pair of in Chroma glasses that I got from my parents for my 17th birthday. I'm 19 now. And I honestly have no clue at all what happened to that old pair. They were sunglasses and they were awesome. I wore them everywhere. I even wore them indoors because it was just so cool how many colors I could see with them. And last thing I know is I'm, I thought I put them in a drawer in my parents' house and back when I was still living with them and I've just never seen them again. This is a little bit harder to open. get started with this one. I do not know which one this is. Oh wait, maybe the box will tell me. Ah, cool. The ones I wanted to start out with. These are the indoor glasses. So these bad boys will help me see color inside, mostly when I'm at work. And they don't give off as much. Actually, I don't know what they do. <laughs> But yeah, they're, these ones are meant for indoors, normal glasses wear, you know, they're not prescription. I don't have any other issue with my eyes besides, um, you know, color. So that's what they come in. They come in this little box and they come with a, they want us to share your reaction. And that's what I'm doing here today. I actually have to go to a local game shop and look for um, D&D dice because my f my fiance's sister plays D&D and she wants to be dungeon master for the first time and wanted to start out with a group of, ki of people who never played it. I've never played it. I think my fiance's played it a little bit. Um, her sister's boyfriend has never played it and Sam, my best friend, has never played it either. But he knows a bit about it. All right, that's everything that's in this box. And it's cool too, because they give you a packet of balloons with of all the different colors so that if you're not like outdoors or you don't really have a lot of colorful things in your house, you got these balloons that you can blow up. All right, so it's just a little slide action. Now this isn't the same case they used to come in. My old pair came in a more traditional, like hard box. I don't know what they're called, but it was definitely not made out of this material. Here they are, boys. Do I look good? All right, it says something about lifting here inside the box. Some kind of, I think that might be like a, a rub cloth. And then there's another thing. Oh, it also got instructions for use inside here. Let's read through it. 
and Chroma CX series lenses and eyewear are intended for use by people with color blindness to improve color discrimination. Color blindness is called is also called color vision deficiency or Daltonism. And Chroma lenses block 100% of UVA and UVB radiation from sunlight. For first time wear, allow at least 10 minutes for your eyes to adjust. Some people experience a strong color enhancement result immediately. However, it may take up to two weeks to adapt to the eyewear. Results vary by type and extent of color blindness. Wear the eyewear in bright light and colorful scenery for best results. And they do also put in a notice that they are not to be used for color vision tests like if you're training to be a pilot or if you're going in the military they do not recommend you wearing these to try to pass the test I'm trying to set the backs up I'll wear these when I go inside Dungeons and Dragons or Sword and Board. That's the shout out, not a sponsor. <laughs> I'll wear these ones when I go inside the store because I'm going to be looking at dice and I've heard D&D &D dice are very colorful. I'm just trying to put everything back. Probably put them back in your case actually. All right, we've got the second box here. This is the outdoor glasses. So the first ones, in case you guys were wondering, they are called Grayson's. And um, Grayson Matte Black CX-1 Indoor DT Lenses. The DT stands for Dutton. When you're looking for indoor glasses for my colorblind folks out there, you wanna look for CX-1 Indoor DT if you know you are Dutton. They have a colorblind test that is actually really cool to do. And I would recommend you guys do that before you try to go online and buy lenses before. So take the test before you do, just to be sure. And these ones were called the Venturas. And again, we got the same deal, more balloons. Share your reaction. Drop stuff. Read this first. I don't think this one was in there. Oh, this one gives you instructions on how to use the sunglasses. First, they recommend you go outside. Then you put them on, keep them on, and avoid flipping the glasses so your eyes can adjust to the new lenses. And they recommend you wear the indoor glasses in well-lit interiors, at the movies, or in front of your TV or computer screen. They work best when there is a bright light source for the indoor ones. All right. Same packaging deal same case. Again, this is not the case that my old pair came in. More rubbing cloths. And then another CX lens series instructions for use that I already read to you guys. I'm actually kind of shaky. I'm a little nervous because it's been forever since I've had colorblind glasses and ever since I lost my old pair, I've always been wanting another pair. Well, now I have two pairs, one for indoor and one for outdoor and it's just, I'm really excited. And that's what these ones look like. I'm already outside, I'm in my car. Should I wait till I get? inside to the store you know what we'll do these ones first again that's what they look like look at my hand you can see my hand shaking I'm just so excited nice little frame oh that's really cool 
the the whatever this part of the frame is is made out of a textured grip unlike the rest okay guys yeah I remember this I remember this when I first put on my last pair and this it's happening with this pair everything is kind of matted with a rose layout like it's filtered with a rose filter it's like a rose red and then over time after like a few minutes it'll start to fade into normal and that's when I'll start seeing the colors really pop I remember this from my last time We're going to give it a few minutes. I'm going to hit pause and we'll get back. I'm not flipping, I'm looking underneath the glasses and comparing with the glasses. I'm not flipping like they warned me about. Just already I'm seeing a difference just inside my car alone. The black looks more black than I've ever seen in this car. I didn't have this car when I had my last pair. There's more There's less blue, I should say. That's what I'm noticing with the black. There's less blue light coming in and more like yellow and red light coming in is what I'm getting at. And so the black looks actually black. I've seen what true black looks like. It's not that hard. It's all colors put together. And this obviously isn't true black. True black is like almost impossible to achieve. But this is crazy that already just in my car, I'm already seeing a difference. I'm looking around. My mother-in-law's green car. <laughs> I'm trying not to cry, guys. There's a red truck over here that is definitely more red than I ever remember seeing it. I'm definitely gonna have to, on my day off, go somewhere with these. The trees have more color to them, more contrast between all the different trees here. There's lots of different trees here. Light greens stand out more than the dark greens and the dark greens stand out more than the light greens <sighs> it's really cool guys I miss this I miss I miss all of this it's been two or three years and I finally can see color again Are those actually pink flowers? Wow. There is definitely a big difference in color, contrast, everything. I could Colors don't look as similar as they do without these. These definitely put a border between one color from another and it's... It's 
it's great. That's all it is. It's just phenomenal. It's it's great. Anyway, I think that'll be it for this video. Um, I'll probably follow up with another review on the indoor glasses. I don't really know anywhere to try indoor glasses and record them at. Because my place is kind of dark. There's It's small, cramped. Everything in there is mostly brown and gray in, t in color. So... Catch you in the next one, guys.